Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to... Oh, shit, I forgot to check my camera. I knocked my camera over earlier today, and uh, is it in position again? Uh, is my face central? Fuck it. You can see my face, you can see my hair. That's what matters. Okay, so I've had a couple of... Well, I've had half a week to decompress from the torrent of just pure filth and shit that flooded my way last time. So, okay, I've relaunched. Um, I've had like 12 hours since releasing the last episode, so I've got some feedback from the last episode. Um, now, okay, multiple things. We're gonna get going here. We're gonna continue um, climbing up and climbing down and whatever in this place, but there's a few things in the town I wanna do and check and read before we start doing shit. First order of business, all right, okay. I spent not even five minutes or something. It was like, it was less than 10 minutes, certainly. Um, it was surprisingly quick. I reloaded the game and I killed the two archers, but more importantly, I killed this top of the stairs fucker and the two clinging on the wall fuckers like five times. I literally killed them, rested the fire, killed them, rested the fire, etc. to stop them spawning. Just to give myself a fucking, le you know, an easier time, because I didn't want to start this episode and just have two or three hours of struggle in the same place. I'd, I'd like to make some progress, you know? So that's all. So just those two mobs up there, the one at the top of the stairs, and then I thought, you know what? Fuck it. Let's let's make it even easier for myself and I killed those two archers only like two or three times more and then they stopped spawning so so that's the first order of business I've made the immediate area safe um, so hopefully when I'm trying to jump down etc I'm not gonna start getting shot by archers and when I climb this ladder I won't get immediately just fucked by a gang of people now let's go travel back to Majula because few things have come to my attention. Um, I should have written all this down, but uh, let's just work off the top of my head. The cat, the kitty cat, has a couple of items, which I read the description of earlier today. Well, 30 minutes ago. Um, and I can't believe I didn't sort of take notice of one of them, which sounds so important. Um, in fact, so important, it might even be helpful in that place where I currently am. Oh. Um. <laughs> you do. Shh, 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 shh. Uh, rings. There's a couple that I took notice of. Reduces damage from falling. Silver ring depicting a leaping feline. Reduces damage from falling. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. And then that one, Ring of Whispers. Hear the inner voices of surrounding foes. Useful for locating hidden enemies. And I'm guessing that just means tricky little bastards hiding around corners. And perhaps for a few other things as well. Nothing suited you. Well now, that can only mean to me, like, either chests, like, through walls, or illusory walls. Now, I haven't really had much of a problem with finding the illusory walls, so I'm, I'm less tempted to buy that. But definitely the falling damage, and I reckon that will let me survive the fall down to there. It, it might even be necessary to get down there. Um, now that's 13,500 souls. So I'm not going to do that now, but once we're done with the Earthen Peak direction, I'll definitely be considering that ring and maybe trying to get down there. Uh, what else? I've checked the two merchants. I can't, I don't think there's anything new. Uh, oh, somebody kindly let me know because I'm an idiot. <laughs> you can buy infinite amount of large upgrade, upgrade shards from Steady Hand Macduff. And speaking of, let's go there. Da -da -da, Steady Macduff's workshop. There we go. I hope to be done in less than 10 minutes so we can get straight to the painful action. But uh, yeah, I did say at the start of this episode I might infuse a weapon. Or certainly upgrade. I'll... So... Da, 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 da. There. You can just buy... I'm sure I saw this at some point, but I forgot. You can just buy infinite large shards. Although they are expensive. Um, so, I've actually got, like, a few. I've got eight large shards, so I can upgrade some weapons. 
Uh, and more importantly, infusion. Now, I think last episode, I did say, didn't I? It made sense to my brain to take um, the katana in the bleed direction. But I've been thinking about it. I know the way bleed works is it builds up over uh, like a few hits and then it does an instant chunk of damage. That's what bleed is. But with katanas, I'm killing... I'm only using the katana on like weaker enemies that die in two or three hits anyway. So thinking about it, bleed is kind of pointless. Because by the time it will do damage, they're already dead. I'm using the big club for tougher enemies. So bleed is literally pointless on the katana. Um, we've got magic, and that's just int scaling, so I'm not bothered about that at all. Um, so no to magic. Fire is the most likely for a, for a quick sword, because that's damage then and there with every swing. So it lowers the physical, but that's got faith scaling, which is kind of a problem. And lightning has lightning scaling? Arr! Okay, fire is faith scaling, but lightning doesn't have a stat, so what the hell is that scaling with? Then you've got dark, still not much of an idea what that is. Uh, poison. I feel the same about poison as I do about fire, it's kind of, it would be helpful on a katana. Um, bleed, meh. Um, do, 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 do. where am I looking? Uh, raw, not bothered. Enchanted. I believe what enchanted is, is is magic, except it, uh, sorry, fuck me, um, yeah, magic, it goes to int scaling, and it does magic damage, but I think enchanted is basically the same, except it doesn't do magic damage, it still does physical, so it scales with int, but it does physical, so, I, you know, that's pointless for me as well. A lot of these seem pointless for my weapon choices. Um, yeah. I'm, mm, for now, I'm going to stick with just upgrading weapons normal. But, I, I, yeah. Infusion might have to wait for a future episode when I'm starting to feel a need for it. Like lightning for armored enemies, you know. But for now, I'm kind of okay. Let's just upgrade some serious shit. Oh, what about infusing the my magic staff? And upgrading it, I completely forgot about that. Oh, you can't put all your status things on. It's just, um, magic? You can upgrade a magic staff with magic. Or dark, okay. I did notice the staffs have some dark damage on as standard. It looks like magic just makes it even more magical and less dark, and dark is the opposite. Okay. Well, honestly, I'm thinking the club comes first. It's I've been having such a whale of a time with that. And that's plus three, my katana's plus five, so fuck it. Let's just go ham with my club. Why not? Why the fuck not? There we go, two more large shards. Fuck. Three more large shards. Fuck it. Oh my god, I can do another one. I've moved on to chunks, finally, with a weapon. I, I was hoping to get a nicer looking club at some point than just, than just a chunk of wood. Maybe like a hammer or something. Um, but until then, I do have two chunks. Let's just do it. Fuck it. I'm not. I'm gonna save more chunks though for other weapons. So my my clubs on plus seven, three hundred and twenty-four damage, dude. It was on like two forty a minute ago. Fucking hell, that thing's gonna clap. Well, I've now got nothing to lose. Um, infusion can wait for another episode, and I've upgraded as much as I want to right now. So. Let's do this. Let's continue. God, that that last death in the at the end of the last episode was so just utterly painful. I finally basically made it and then I just slid off the edge of the world. 
Um, right, okay. I kind of want to see what the damage of this is like. Um, I'm forgetting something. What am I forgetting? Uh, I saw something else. That's it. Magic. Um, real quick. Something very important I noticed at the end of the last episode. That item I got that Pate wanted or whatever was that the third highest rank of the spell things I'm using. I'm using the 30 basics, the 15 greats. I got that. 10 uses of great heavy soul arrow. Now I noticed it's only one magic slot and it's only two more int requirements than these two. Um, I've got perfectly 14 for that spell. If I just put two more points in, I can use the great heavy soul arrows. Now, I've spent my shit, so I can't do that now, but... I've checked, and there's one ring I don't really care about having on. It's that one. Stone ring for the poise damage. I could easily put the attunement thing on and just equip a third spell, which would be great. So I think the next two levels I'll put into int. Bump that up to 16. Right, let's do this. I did miss, by the way. There was a direction I could have gone. Um towards the end of the last episode. But, obviously, we are here to get this g -darn item over there. Oh, fuck! Hang on, I thought... Okay. Fine. I thought I killed all, them, all the guys up here. Okay. All I want is that item. And then we can just fuck off finally. Oh, fuck off. I'm gonna just kill everything. I'm gonna just kill it all. Just, I wanna, just this first attempt at the very least. I just wanna take my damn time. Let's kill the one down here as well. I'm not sure how he missed that attack. Let's just do my customary check that my recording is going fine. Yeah, okay. Okay. All is looking good. I bet my club one-shot kills these guys, actually. Let's whip out the club. So, the direction I could have continued is that is down there, I'm pretty sure. So we know where to go. Or is it down there? That's where Pate is. Nope, he's gone. Never mind. Okay. So this is the shortcut, so I don't have to do any more dodgy jumping. And the archers are dead. No, uh, yeah, this is it. Now, I wonder if I need the ring to survive this jump. Like, regardless? Um. Well, I'll just flask. I might even need to be human and on full health to survive this. Um, let's let's do the geometry here. Last time I jumped what I thought was perfectly, but I landed on the the fucking thing there, the 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 thing, uh, the doorway thing, and I slid off. I did the landing roll across that beam thing and just fell off to my death. Do I have to land directly on the ground? You do fly quite horizontal when you jump. Oh, 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 what is wrong with me? Oh, I'm alive. Okay, thank fuck. Oh, hello. Uh, okay. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> okay. Lightning sp- Oh. Is that my first lightning weapon? Natural lightning weapon. Uh... We've got whatever the fuck that is. We've got an enchanted magical... Is it a magic spell? Like a lightning faith... A, a faith... What the fuck am I clicking on? Oh my god. Lightning spear. I bet it is. It, yeah, I remember now. You, you could buy that from that swindling lady. Lysia of Lindelt. Okay. 
thanks for all the feedback, by the way. I had one guy say he used faith builds in every game. I was sorely tempted to go full sorcerer in this game. I am even more tempted to either go full sorcerer or full faith build for Dark Souls 3. That might be a, a hell of a time. How did I not see this ledge before? Because this is now a piss easy jump. S sort of. <laughs> it's easier than from up there for fuck's sake. You know what, this is a lesson in always check your surroundings. Now let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do a couple of practice direction runs. I don't want to go straight across because I'll roll off the other side, I know I will. So I want a slight angle. Um, <laughs> I don't want to hit my head on any cogs or anything. I reckon that angle there is pretty much solid. I just gotta breathe, and all will be okay. I've only got to kill a couple of fuckers to 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 to. I need to treat this like one big old learning thing. How did I not possibly see this last time? What an idiot I am. Okay, heal. Um. Now, I suffered from what I thought I would suffer from. I, I went too far. So, I need to increase the angleage. Oh, God. Um, I, what was my angle last time? It was like that. I landed, like, way further than I thought I was going to land. Um... Fuck off, would you? Would you just fuck off? Go to hell, bitch. Fuck. My guy would def defo win gold at the long jump in the Olympics. What the fuck sort of leg strength have I got to leap like a fucking gazelle? Like, the distance, the, the sheer distance I'm getting is crazy. Like, Cray cray. <laughs> Fucking hell. Have you seen how far you go? Bloody hell. Right, come on. Jump at me, bitch. I ain't scared of you. Fuck you. We're doing excellent. <laughs> no, we're not, but uh. Fuck it, we're doing excellent. It's times like these I need to be my own hype man. I'm going to get more of an angle. I'm going to go from, like, here. Per perfection. It was that easy the whole time. Poison broadsword. Here's the big deal, right? Human effigy and poison broadsword. Illusory wall. How's that not a fucking illusory wall, man? I'm no Okay. Let's, let's give that a read. Um, 84 physical. That has to be one-handed. Like a, like a small weapon. 84 physical, 112 poison. When I tried putting the poison infuse on my katana, that was like 120, 120, which is way higher. Hmm. Hmm. Not quite the... What did I just equip? Okay. No. <sighs> That's not an illusory war. So how the fuck do I get out of here? I can probably leap over there. And that is like a, a way to go as well. So, okay. Hello. Hello. I see shit down there, and stairs and stuff. Oh no, sorry, that's the way into this place. My bad. Right, I think we're good. I think we're golden. 
<laughs> Hell yes. Okay, right. Onwards with our adventure. No more pissing about with jumps. Ooh, right, okay. So those that's beneath this. Um now this was an elevator, so at some point we've got to raise that. I've had people tell me some of you when the fuck where the fuck do these guys come from? One attack at a time. Fuck. Just fucking hell. Just just fuck. These guys are the worst guys ever. In any Dark Souls game. Fast, bleed and poison. Right, I took one look down here. Uh, yeah, I took one look down here and then I, t I fucked off last episode, so... Yeah. What's this one gonna do? There's no poison thing on the ceiling. Oh, oh. Yes, this will take me up. And I've already killed the two fuckers, so yeah. Cool. Anything good? Oh. Mirror shield. Okay. Let's get that a little read. Multiple people have come from the land of mirror. Uh, there we go. Uh, not bad stats. Shield issue to the proud knights of Mirror's official order. In Mirror, a land perennial, perennial, uh, per perennially beset by unrest, this shield was a symbol of the great knight's strength and willingness to give their lives for their country. The merchant comes from the land of Mirror. And I think Lucatil Luc comes from Mira with her brother. Okay. Ooh. Hello. Oh, well, there you go. Ha. Simpleton Spice. Uh, see, down there, there's the ledge I wanted to get on down, down there. I might be able to fall down. Oh. By the way, uh, okay, I've noticed the summon sign. This one has more health than the others. Didn't help him. Right, who's the summon sign for? Bashful Ray. Seen him before. No, thank you. Shortcut open, thank fuck for that. Oh! Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt your evening. Shall I leave one fence up just to fuck with viewers that have like OCD? <laughs> no. Let's get 100%. So I've got your shortcut. I've got some illusory wall looking places. Um, I could probably rest, get a flask back, kill that fucker again. I'm still curious where that fucker was that, to that was tossing bombs at my ass. From all the way up top. It must be somewhere up around there. And I'm not going to make the same mistake of constantly losing like 9,000 souls, by the way. As soon as I get like, what, 13 or 14,000, I'm going to go level up with them immediately. Or, uh... Or better yet, you know, I could just buy that, that falling ring, get it out of the way so I've always got that to fall back on. Hello? Hello? I like your hair and your beard, sir. Shush. You Egypt. Stay quiet. <laughs> we got an Irish fella. I'm on the run. Don't give me away. Why is he grabbing his belly? You're a fugitive too, eh? Yeah. Why else would you be here? It's got death written all over it. 
That might have to be a thumbnail. Who is this then? I need a name check. You want to climb down here? Oh, I can lend you a ladder. Oh. Well, um, <laughs> how much can you offer me? Hang on. A ladder you, down to where? I'm trying to help you, you know. Okay, this guy's a stingy no shit. Downright rude, really. Do I have an option to give him money? I, I, I've, got, I've got a soft heart, so. Oh, this guy's full of shit. I, I let you off. This once. I swear to God. Oh, that. Uh, fuck it, take him. All right. It'll be just a moment. It'll it'll be progress. Just take my damn souls. Let's let's. He might be a swindling bastard, just like Lysia, but just just fine. Okay. People in this game are more full of shit than the first game. Just uh, go on ahead. I won't offer this deal twice. Okay. Let's continue some talking. Oh. oh right. Okay. Well, I paid the two thousand souls to have this menu. Fuck the ladder for now. What's he got to sell? Claw. Ooh, claws. Um, whip claws shield. Uh, bleed, etc. Da -da 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 -da. Wooden club with nails, designed as a deadlier club. Ooh. That's a, like a smaller one-handed club, though. Uh, lion shield. What else have we got? A thief. Oh. Black leather. I wore that set in the first game for quite a while. Allows the wearer to blend in with the dark. Hmm. Okay. Decent poison resist. And he sells n bleeding knives, magic weapon things, and bleeding things. And a miniature ladder for 6399 souls. An ornament depicting a ladder. A small orna ornamental ladder. A quaint little thing, but only for show. This ornament does not seem to have any particular function and should not be worth much, but is sold at an exorbitant price. There is no way that's not for nothing. That's got a. Uh, I wonder if that'll work as a ladder to go down that hole in Medulla or something. Maybe it grows into a full size ladder or something. I don't know. Prostration. Mm -hmm, thank you. Have you heard? I haven't heard. Well, apparently, there's this monster lady, right? The queen? The poison well, does wonders for her body. You know, uh, health, beauty, and that sort of stuff. Oh, hang on. Is he saying poison is... is... I thought only human women were so petty. Is he saying poison is, is strong to use against this woman? Or is he saying the opposite, and she needs poison to survive or some shit? That creature. She was human once, you know? I'm looking forward to this fight. In fact, she was wed to the prince of that nearby castle. But her husband? Uh, he had feelings for another. The princess was desperate and sought eternal beauty. Princess? D did she become the oh, queen that we've heard of? Restored the prince's uh, affection. <laughs> you see what I mean? Why should she need the, the prince's affection? Fuck the prince. Before long, the princess's <laughs> ire transformed her into a monster. Mm. Now, listen here. When do you think this all happened? A few thousand years ago, maybe? Long ago, when this very land was called something else. Mm. We say Dranglet now, but... Countless kingdoms have risen and fallen on this very spot. Interesting. And this won't be the last? Oh no. That Interesting. Just can't let her old flame go. She's going to get us out. I wonder where she is. Like, I've, I've got a fog door up there. I guess maybe that's simply it. God almighty. I'm not going to do it this time. We've got an array of um, nationalities in this game. We've got a Scottish guy, now we've got an Irish guy. Most people are sort of English, 
generally speaking, with their accent. God, uh, okay, here we go. Right, so I paid 2,000 souls for access to a couple of basic things. A miniature ladder. And then an actual ladder. So where's this going? Uh, let's take it all in. Let's shit further up. We got winged butterflies. Mothy bitches. But I paid really for this ladder, so let's just go down it, I guess. What's with all the fuckers swindling you out of your money in this game? Right, so this this better be worth it. Ooh, that it worth it. An upgrade and a Pharis Lockstone. Nice. Now, is this... This is the loot that I saw. Okay, great. Nice. Mystery solved. Still no Lucatiel summon sign, by the way. Uh, she, she, we saw her earlier in this very area. There was no summon sign for the slug boss. And we've had we've got someone else's summon sign here. Bashful Ray. That's hard to see, by the way. But I wonder if um, we'll see her name maybe before the fog door. I think we've got everything, haven't we? Other than the fog door. Let's rest. Uh, not too bothered about 3,500 souls, you know. If I've got under, like... 8,000 is my number. If I've got under 8,000, I'll just continue to play and go forward. Or should I say 10,000? I need a number that I'm happy to lose, you know? Let's just progress to the fog door and f for the first time clear everything. Uh, and not die. Is he gonna follow me when I'm out of line of sight? The fuck? I can't be asked losing him. One thing I did get, by the way, I got a claw from killing these guys before the episode. They're mannequin claws. So I've already got one set of claws. If I can dual wield claws literally like Wolverine. Claws used by the mannequins of Harvest Valley. The peculiar art of puppetry is a vested... Uh, the queen entranced by poison used it to beckon... Okay, same description. I'm unclear from what he said, whether poison is strong against her or weak against her. The way that that Irish fellow worded it, it could have gone either way. It, 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 they weren't clear at all. Fuck! I'm gonna back off. I'm gonna back off and fight this fucker down here. Come at me. Oh, he's dying to poison. Oh, it's one of these guys. Sorry, I thought it was, yeah, one of the other basic ones. Shadow top, that's what I'm wearing already. Oh, where's this fire lady? Charge! Oh fuck, oh fuck. No! Bad! What? what? No! Oh, 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 sorry lady. Oh. By the way, I'd like to echo a previous point from last episode. I haven't seen any sconces to light for ages. Like, four episodes or something. So I don't know if that's just in earlier parts of the game or what, but... I had nothing for a while. Right, okay, so we've got that place going up there. Let's just kill these guys, just so the whole place is safe. Oh, fucking hell! 
I forgot that one-handed power attack is a is. A, uh, what the fuck? Oh. oh my god, we've got multiple. That's two hand. Bad. Bad. Oh my god. Oh fuck's sake, can I land an attack please? There you go. What do these drop? A poison stone? That's an upgrade fucking thing, isn't it? Well, at least I'm full health. Bloody hell. Da -da 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 Fuck, that was an impressive bit of loot to get from just a basic enemy. Alright. Okay, now is this poison? It is. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We've got two little bowls. Let's go up here. Ah, hang on, I can hear some serious shit. What's that? Oh, it's these little shits. Well, can they poison themselves? If I get them to attack. Okay. All right. All right. Let's just let's just slam these guys. Oh, I feel bad. They're just like innocent walking mushrooms with legs. I've got to be careful though. Uh, in fact, let's just waste some shitty arrows. Get rid of these things. Be gone, pots. All right, so far, so good. We've got a Faris Lockstone, and I've now got two of those things, by the way. I already had one, so let's just use it. So far, every time I've had to use a Faris Lockstone, I've got some fantastic loot. Better than that bullshit from that jump down there. But, uh... Ooh, nice. Oh, fuck. Yeah, every Faris Lockstone and Branch of Yore has been worth it, so let's just use every single one of them. Hello there! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you! You horrible, gangly shit! Dark gauntlet and work hook. Fucking hell, that's the first one of those I've seen. Oh, they're worse than the first game because they just walked upright in the first game. They're like spiders in this one. Uh, that nearly killed me, by the way. Fuck. Good Jesus. Oh, uh, can I? Cosplay as Captain Hook. A hook that covers the hand. Clearly not intended as a weapon, but certainly sharp enough to shred an enemy's skin. Well, there you go. Interesting. That's it. Fucking hell. I've been here for 20 years looking. It's a pair of gloves. Dark gauntlets. I think that's what it was. Gauntlets of a knight subsumed by dark. No one knows the true identity of these men. Are those the gloves of the guy that was outside further down? The, uh, the, the, the bigger versions of the fast attacky guys that lunge at you and shit. Freely manipulate dark. Old for poor souls who chase the lost of, okay. Hang on. Poor souls who chase the lost art of life drain. I wonder if dark drains life? Um. Well, it's way fucking heavy for a pair of gloves. It's got great stats. Okay. 
Well, thanks for that. Let's use my lockstone. Okay, we got some poison. All good. Just some basic poison. Um, can I, can I, uh... Okay. Let me just, uh... Well, I was gonna break everything, but is that, has that revealed some shit somewhere else? Every other Faris Lockstone has been, like, the, the image thing has been very close by. If you tell me now that this is a bullshit one and it's just there to poison you. Okay, something is moving. Let's just keep going. Maybe it's up here somewhere. Oh, fuck you. I mean, I don't know if there's any telltale signs about trap... Trap monsters. Ooh, I've got a couple of things to give the little bird thing now. Um, so what's the deal? What's the deal with Q-tips? Another wall here, maybe? Yes. Anything good? Oh, fuck, yes. Nice. Um... Bit right before I rest. <laughs> And respawn everything known to man. Can I figure out where the fuck? Let's just check for walls around here. You never know. Is it? Have I literally wasted a fucking lockstone like for cereal? Because if I have, that's kind of shitty. That there's a such few and far between sort of rare items. But that really sucks. I don't know what the point of this is, but... <laughs> right, it looks like that's just meant to poison you. But I mean, it doesn't exactly do a great job of killing you or, you know... If that's a trap just for lols, it's not a great trap. But okay. Maybe it has some... Uh, so, you know, maybe it's done something that I can't see yet. Maybe, you know, maybe there is a thing somewhere. Or it's opened a door or something, you know what I mean? Well, that was a waste of a fucking lockstone, it's a uh, lot, it seems. That, that's almost a good metaphor for life. You know, some you, you've got to break some eggs to make an omelette or whatever the saying is. And sometimes in life you break some eggs and you don't even get the omelette. You get what I'm trying to say. Some, so sometimes shit just doesn't have any result. Effort in, nothing out. Uh, well, let's just rest, fuck it. Maybe something will happen. Um, I guess, is there a, can I drop down there, ooh, and, uh, yeah, not hit the poison. Right, let's do the fog door then, there's no, hang on, I've got to kill this fucker again, that's fine, it's fine, it's all part of the plan, it's all part of the plan. <sighs> I've got quite a reach with this. What did I say at the start of last episode? Their set would be awesome to have. Okay. Please tell me this is not putting me overweight and it's just awesome. Oh, Jesus Christ, it's just a bra. I wanted the cloak that comes with it. It's way worse on the poison, so I'm not going to be equipping it for now. Awesome though it might look. It's, uh, it's got some curse resist, uniquely. And some magic resist. So it's good for magic, petrify, curse. And I've got to put it... I've got to see it. You know what I mean? So it's just straight up a... Uh, damn, I'm yoked. <laughs> I'm yoked with a bra. 
Fucking I've got a six pack. I wanted the cloak that comes with it, unless that's part of their headpiece. Because it is like a hood that flows down the shoulders. So that might be the headpiece. But um, we're going with function over sexy bra for now. Okay. Now let's re-kill these guys and let's do the fog door. It's, it's been an hour in the making. Which is ridiculous by the way, but fuck it. Club's coming out. Great soul hours at the ready, and I'm only one flask down. 9,000 souls. It's fine. I've got confidence. Uh, oh, did I roll in the poison so I got fully covered? Shit. Hang on. Hang on. <laughs> Let's let that run out. There we go. If this is your so-called queen, maybe I would benefit from using that poison sword that I just got. But this club is so fucking high damage. You know what I mean? I think this would just outdo any poison weapon anyway. Right. What have we got here? Mitha, the ba- Oh, fucking poison. Po- She's holding her own head! Right, I'm getting poisoned. That's fine. But what a fucking painful fight. Oh, fucking hell. Right, okay. I'm just gonna have to flask period. I'm not gonna poison cure. I'm gonna- I'm gonna die, but it's fine. Fucking hell! That's sheer damage. Ow. Fucking hell, that's some- I'm gonna heal again. I wonder if I can straight flask the damage. It's fine. Oh, bad. Stamina, stamina. Oh, she got me. Fucking hell, what a creepy lady. She's got horns and spiky hair. That's like one of the undead female styles of hair in World of Warcraft, by the way. But she's holding her own head. I don't know why, she, it makes me think of Medusa. Alright, okay. Alright. I'm no longer human, but that's fine. I'm pretty sure... There was no Lucatiel summon sign. That's like all I care about at this point. So I'm fine for just, just killing the boss. I can flask that poison damage quite comfortably. As long as I back off from the boss, because she has like lots of downtime without when she doesn't attack you. So I don't think I need to bother with poison resist or anything. Um, now, what's the best way to do this? I'm not sure I can be arsed killing like seven fuckers every time. I wonder. Oh god. Um, I've got 9,000 souls on the line, but I wonder if I can drop down between them and just run straight to the boss door. They are quite big, and the hitboxes that... L it's not easy to run past motherfuckers in this game. Uh... Bleed stone. Okay, that's a poison stone and a bleed stone from these little wenches. I mean, that's great loot. Um, I'm going to use a life gem, so I've got all nine flasks. I'm going to need them for the poison. Oh, fuck. This is... Okay, that's deeper than I thought it would was. Shit. Okay. Um, I suppose it doesn't matter. You get instantly poisoned anyway. I'm not going to make that shitty mistake. We're going to get our souls, and then we're going to kill a motherfucker. There you go. That's a, have you seen the reach of her weapon, by the way? What a weapon that is. Oh, that's fuck all. She's so resistant to magic. Back off. I think she's going to do some weird shit. 
Okay, no, fuck that. We're clubbing a motherfucker. Stamina. I might even heal again, honestly. Let's just go- let's just drain through my shit. My flasks. Bah. Okay. Okay. So she can just shotgun magic. <laughs> just black dead. Right. Okay. It looked like one of her attacks there was like a grab. So she can like grab you and do some weird, weird shit to you from the front or she can shock and magic you so here's the plan i'm not going to be in front of her like no matter what we're going to her side or behind her um but this is so high damage if i just keep doing the odd power attack with the club it, i think it's going to be quite easy now um i can make it in the gap there can't i uh my problem here is going to be the landing animation and then these guys are going to be swatting me like a bastard immediately. You know what, fuck the 9,000 souls. Uh, it's just sometimes in life. Charge! Quickly! Well, that's nice to see. That's nice and easy. Nice and easy. How did that hit me then? Okay, her head can be tossed like a grenade. And then she grabs her head back. Okay, nice. Do, do you magic shit so I can heal? Never mind, I've got to do it now. That's it. That's fantastic. Fucking hell. That's fine. That's good. Hit her in the foot. Hit her in the, the singular foot. Five flasks left. I've got to, like, go for it. This is, this is a DPS check. She was, like, stunned there. Do you see that? Three flasks left. <sighs> One flask left. Fuck off! <laughs> Alright, okay. Uh, I ran out of flask. Uh, right, okay, th this is... This is a DPS check, is what this is right here. I just need to get in the attacks. Bullshit that the that one of those head grenades uh, caught me from very far away, but hey, it is what it is. None of this really matters as long as I keep looting my souls back. This is this is if come on. This is to get my souls. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. <laughs> yeah, I think be being point blank is literally better. And then she just gave me a slight hip bump and I'm dead. 
What a powerful set of hips this serpent woman has. Fucking hell. The fucking reducing health is a real pain here. Have you noticed? Like... Right, I think the key, the key with those fuckers is make them attack me, because then I've got time. Fucking hell, your health goes down fast from poison. My stamina, come on, stamina. God. My biggest problem here is legitimately my my health just lowering every time. Uh, is there any rings that are going to help me here? I've got your poison resist ring on, so that's that's already there. My poison my um that poise breaking thing is almost irrelevant against a boss like this. Is there anything that will just straight fucking help? She's resistant as shit to magic. Increases physical attack and me more damage, more HP for me. Physical defense might be a shout. But then she is magicking a lot of my damage. Sometimes. Increases poise. Eh. I'm gonna put on Ring of Blades. Just so I'm doing maximizing my damage. And if I'm a, I'm happy to go down to ten effigies. I want full health. It, mm, the speed of the, the katana might be preferable, honestly. But then the, the sheer damage with a single slam of this weapon is great. Um, either way, I don't need it. Let's try a katana. Let's try a katana. Unless, unless her scales count as armor so that that's why my hammer is doing so much damage. This might be preferable. Just the faster attacks. Perfect. Whoa, okay. Fuck, oh, she's got me. She's got me coiled like a motherfucker. I'm a fuck the Can I get Bashful Ray on the case? <laughs> should I summon Bashful Ray? Or should we not be a little bitch? Right, I think right, I'm going to attack her every time she does that because I was waiting for her to attack me so that I could attack her, but then I'm poisoned and I'm wasting time. If I can just get in one quick, one quick attack and then start dodging, then we're laughing. I'm glad you're invincible for that fucking second. Fuck off, man. <laughs> fuck off, man. Would you just fuck off? You wormy serpent bastard. Fuck. Should I just go full ape shit with my... I should I should at least have the staff at the ready because the shield is fucking pointless. 
unless I could block some of her basic attacks, but then she'll just grab me and, and coil me like a coily bastard again. So, no, Staff at the Ready. I'm tempted to use all 45 spells. It is low damage, but so is the, so is the katana, kind of. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's try it. Let's just try going spell mental. Can't see, can't see. Camera, fuck. It's fine. It, I, did, I, 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 I. Can't even see, man. Lock on. Right. Okay. Let's get some distance. Oh, that, 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 that is so brutally difficult. Oh. oh. Right. Okay. I keep thinking she's doing a light attack lunge but she doesn't she does the wind up and then she rushes she locks onto you so she can curve and she runs towards you and then does the lunge i need to not roll immediately i need to wait a split second to see if it's just a light attack or it's the chase you attack because the chasing one i need to wait before i roll can we all agree on that fact right these two fuckers are actually a real problem Faster, 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 No! No! Oh, fucking hell, man. Would you just fuck off? Oh, I'm fucked. I am actually fucked. Bright side, bright side, look at the positive, look at the positive, look at the fucking positive! <sighs> I may have lost nine, uh, eleven thousand, ten thousand or eleven thousand souls. But now I've got fuck all to lose. Now I'm free to do whatever the fuck I want to my heart's content. I need them both to attack me, there. So then I have time. There. Once you start the walkthrough... Once you start the walkthrough of the door, that's when you're invulnerable. You don't have a fucking second. You don't have a fucking second. She lunges you, then she's doing a triple light attack on you. Oh, what a horrible wench. What a horribly disgusting serpent. I'm gonna turn her snaky skin into a fucking scarf. Or better yet, like, snake skins are like, are like, f in, like whole things, aren't they? Like a tube. I'm going to turn her snaky skin into a sleeping bag. And I'm going to enjoy a comfortable night's sleep in her fucking corpse. Come on, just, just, you need like one, two, right, it's a full two seconds before you're invulnerable. Jesus Christ. Oh God. Fuck! What the fuck are you meant to do about that? Oh my God. Where are you supposed to run? Oh. 
Why? 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 I'm, I'm having typical liquid blitz bullshit syndrome here, where my first attempt seemed almost laughably easy. I was out healing all your... I'm going back to the club. I, I'm, I was out healing all the poison damage quite comfortably to the point where she was on like 30% health or something. And I died from a lunge attack, not even the poison. And then it's, it seems to be getting harder and harder and harder. We're going back to, to, to slam attacks. We're going back to full health. I've got more damage now because of that ring. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do what I did. I'm going to sort of stay medium range because too close and she starts shotgunning you and grabbing you and coiling you. Too far and she lunges after you. I think she can only do that chasing lunge shit when you're too far away, so I think medium range is pretty fucking solid and perfect. There. Perfect. If Right, if I just wait, it, that's perfect. Right, come on, come at me. Thing is on my stamina. I need to slam attack. I need to slam attack only when I've got full stamina, otherwise I'm fucked afterwards. It's fine, it's fine. I, I don't wanna Oh, the running attack is a slam. I didn't realize that. Oh, that's actually really, really good. Let's do that. Excellent. See, nice and easy, but I need to heal now. It's fine. Hey, it's fine. Let's go closer again. Let's go closer again. Nice and easy. Now I'm going to heal again. Let's go back to again closer because I don't want to get lunged at. Even my light attack is fucking high damage. You're not tailing me and I'm healing. Excellent. Not, not locking on is the fucking secret, man. Just one more attack and we're good. Fuck you, you poisony woman! Um, fog doors and shit. Because I am... Soul. 20,000 things, that's, that's irrelevant. Uh, let's get out of the poison. And we'll heal. We'll, we'll just, we'll just, just cancel. I wasn't... I wasn't poisoned. <laughs> that was a waste. Oh, I don't care. I don't care. We're going to spend our souls before fucking anything else, okay? Before I even have to fight, like, the weakest bitch ever. I'm going to spend these souls, because of... Oh, right, of course. Right, okay. Ha ha, motherfuckers! Is someone getting poisoned? Fuck you! That's what happens. Yeah! Collapse on the floor in a heap of dog shit. You, 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 these guys are the reason I lost 10,000 souls to the boss, essentially. That's right. I'm gonna enjoy every second here, just, just, yeah. You can't quite get to me, can you? There's too long a distance between us. You're gonna die. <laughs> Fuck you! Oh, he's got loot. Oh. Well, I'm not gonna get poisoned. Let's get the shield out, and the club. Shield raised. Right, we've got a fire. Bond. No, we don't. We've got a torch, okay. Any traps? Any any problems? Any illusory walls? I can't believe I lost 10,000 souls. Hmm. Have we learned a lesson from that boss? Other than this game likes to kick you when you're down. 
I think the lesson I'm going to take from that shit is to trust my instinct. And if something like works pretty well the first time, why change it? Why change? Why did I go to like a katana or try magic when I nearly had her the first time? So if some if something seems to be clearly effective, fuck that loot. Just stick to it. You know. I wish I'd have remembered that the running attack with it was a slam as well, because that's faster and less stamina, I believe, than it, yeah, it is, than the basic power attack. Way less. Oh my god. Way less stamina for the running attack. Yeah. And it was like the same damage. Okay. At least we killed her and she gave me a nice crisp 20,000 souls to spend. I'll buy that falling ring now. While I have the fucking funds for it. Before I lose said funds. Mitha the Baneful Queen Soul. I'm guessing this was your princess. Uh, I wonder who the prince was. Soul of Mitha, the serpent woman, who lives in the earthen peak. The queen sought the kings of... It was princess and prince, I guess that's now queen and king. Even poisoning herself to attain beauty, despite the monstrous consequences, all for the compelling madness known as love. Use the special soul of the queen to acquire numerous souls. I'm going into my strange old man voiceover voice. Deckard Cain. Uh, to create something of great worth. Okay. So, Strayed, by the way, I'm pretty sure will be back where I first found him because he wasn't in Majula. So, I do need to go back to speak to him again. Uh, I'm guessing that is to just pull this elevator back down. Um... Okay, so yeah, I'll go back to him and look at the boss weapons again. Um, and just in case you can do something else with your boss souls. And I think you can because I have more boss souls than there were options for boss weapons to buy from him. Um, so I will only spend a boss soul with Strayed if it's like a weapon I particularly want. Otherwise, I think I'll save him. I, I sort of did the same in Elden Ring, where I only spent a Remembrance if it was really a, a weapon I wanted. Like, I think I bought the Omen King's purple sword with one of the Remembrances in that game, etc. I'm thinking maybe a great sword of some kind if he's got one. Right, well, we're not out of the woods yet. I was hoping for a fucking... Bonfire sooner. Oh shit, man. Oh. Right, that is not a skeleton that's coming back to life. Iron keep. Am I human? I am human. Oh, at least that last effigy wasn't wasted, eh? Hey? Dude. What's that planet in Star Wars with the lava that um Darth Vader, technically, and Obi-Wan fight on in Revenge of the Sith. Mus is it Mustafar? Dude, lava planet. Even the sky looks like it's on fire. Cool. Dude, it's all like broiling and boiling. Well, I'm guessing that's instant death. And surprise me at some point if Elo loot over there. Yeah, if at some point you drain the lava or some shit. Well, there's a bonfire. Now, clearly, <laughs> this that is on fire, so I'm going to take fire damage from that. Let's go spend my souls. I think the fall damage ring is in order. Is this on the list now? Iron Keep? Dude, this looks like an advanced area of the game. Even the image is like scary. But we can come back here, so let's fuck off. 
I guess we should just continue with the Iron Keep. We started with Harvest Valley. Um, uh, did we start with Harvest? No, we started with um, the, the place before the Harvest Valley, whatever it was called. Undead Purgatory, maybe? No, Huntsman's Copse. So Huntsman's Copse led to Harvest Valley, which led to Earthen Peak, which now has led to the Iron Keep. So, clearly I'm on like a lengthy path of the game. Let me buy your ring. There we go. Yeah. Satisfied? I am. Oh. Uh, so yeah. Oh, hello. There he is. Anything new for me? Wait. You found your way out too. <laughs> the name's Gilligan. Don't make me say it twice. Can people let me know if this is an actual... I, I don't want to make the mis... Right. What do you want? I don't want to make the same... Everything you need. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I don't want to make the same mistake as I did with the Scottish guy and, and say that's not a real Scottish voice actor when it is. Is this a real Irish voice actor? Because I swear I heard a hint of Scottish accent in there for a split second. What? Don't right. Yeah. I feel odd that this guy sells that bullshit little ladder item so fucking close. So fucking close to the place where you would need a ladder. I bet. Alright. Oh, I should have listened to the warnings. This place is flippin' mental. Flippin'? Huh? No, I wasn't born here. I'm, I'm from a wee bit. I'm from a wee bit out west. That's all. West? I've seen some rough times. I think I'll settle down for a while. Hmm, let's keep talking. You wouldn't believe the shenanigans that happen in my business. I thought at, at least here in the middle of nowhere, I could stay clear of, you know, my old pals. Old Lang Syne? Don't ask me what happened. Have you no discretion, me old chum? What happened? That gaping hole. Hell. Can you drop a ladder down? It's where the people around here toss all their rubbish. Corpses, or you know what. Or whatever they'd rather be rid of. Hmm. Oh, and, and those human statues. Who are they supposed to be? Those Anybody things. Probably just some old pagan costume. You know, only after he said that, um... Why in the hell would I know? Only after he made that reference to the hole in the earth have, have I just realised they toss all their shit down here. This is exactly like the hole in, in Sparta? In the movie 300? You have that big hole in the centre of the town. Oh yeah, somebody told me that the grave of, of a saint lies below here. Oh shit. No, not built by the king, no, no. It did back to that time long before him. The tomb connects to that hole. And there's... Okay. There's something about some... Some rat king down there. Hell, <laughs> if the old rat is okay. rich, as they say, maybe I should go and pay him a visit. Rats are dangerous enemies in Dark Souls. They're fast and crazy. So he's mentioned a rat king and some sort of soul of the dead. Set up ladder! Hang on, was that option there the, the entire time? Oh, I should have listened to the... Right, he's repeating himself. Huh? Okay. So, right, I'm guessing you could do it with the ring. Um, or enough health, maybe. I don't know if falling is a percentage of your health bar, no matter how big your health bar is. Or if it's a fixed amount of damage, so putting enough points into health, I'd be able to survive the fall. But I th I'm, I'm pretty confident the ring will let me survive that fall. Or I could have just gone to where I did and get this guy to set me up a ladder. You want to go down that awful hole? You must have lost your marbles. <laughs> I've got all my marbles. Fine, sure, fine. I'm happy to be of service. Right. You need a ladder then, sure enough. Where's the ladder going to come from? You'll have to show some generosity. <sighs> Where's 
Right, okay. Is this three different lengths of ladder? <laughs> and you're going to take some fall damage based on how much you give him? Let me guess here. Giving him the full whack, 12,000 souls. I bet it's a full ladder from top to bottom and you can just go up and down as you please. Although that's pointless because you're never going to come back up because once you fall off the first plank, you won't be able to get back up anyway. I reckon three and a half thousand souls might take you halfway down to the plank thing there and maybe 500. It's just a little ladder at the top that uh, you can just survive the fall. Um, nothing for now. We'll we'll decide this after I'm done with the iron keep. Uh, so what's he got? Still does the same shit. Yes. Hang on, that price has gone up. It was six three nine nine. It's now eight thousand. The fuck? Is that because I insulted him then? You wouldn't. Be I thought at, at least here in the middle. Of yeah, he's repeating himself. Okay. What? Well, I bought the full ring, so that's that's forever a part of my shit. Mm. You know what? Now I'm out of poison land. Don't waste my time. That's a good point. Now I'm out of poison land. I highly doubt I need the ring. It's a nice thing to have. It doubles my poison resist. Even with high poison resist gear, but I mean, I just I just don't need it if I'm not in a poison area. Do I have a fire resist ring? Because I'm entering the land of fire. I don't think I do. I'm pretty sure I'd have like a red ring or something, you know. Well, you know what? I'm half tempted to put on your your souls ring plus one because I'm starting to spend and need so many fucking souls. I don't have any fire protection room. Literally gonna put more souls on. I think. Uh, and damage, I might as well keep damage on, really. Keep damage on. Let's go. I think I'm very soon gonna branch out to new weapons, though. At least types I haven't used yet. Like claw weapons. Do I not have two claws yet? I've got a hook and a claw. Is that a... Will that power stands? <laughs> I've got one set of claws and I can buy a second set. So I, I could potentially power stance a couple of fucking claws. Um, okay, okay, right, okay. I've learned something. <laughs> I've learned fire is fucking high damage, but it's, it's, <sighs> oh god, um, I'll come back to that in the future, that will kill me, like, how, how fast is that damage? I reckon that's two ticks per second, so, duh, 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 that's like two to three full seconds I'm dead I'll die on that loot if I can even get it and then I won't get my souls back I'll save that for a rainy day fuck me sorry we will get to the action soon I've just realized I'm in a fire area I'm gonna want fire resist now so let's switch away from poison stuff to fire stuff I might have my best fire stuff on actually so far it's the best for fire yeah, I've got the best fire top on. Gloves. That's slightly better, but that's heavy as fuck. Um, oh, my, right, some panzer. Oh shit, that's even better. I'm still not overweight. With more poisoned fires. Yeah, that's it. What about head? Just, just. Yeah, okay, fine. Right, put on those legs. Yep. Tiny bit more. That's it. Ooh, I like the sound effect. Cool. Okay. Any horrible shit gonna happen? Hello. 
I meant to pull the shield out. Oh, my sh he doesn't get right. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay, I thought he'd be tougher. What a basic bitch. Am I still human? Yes. My human, my humanity check is me looking in my ear. Because <laughs> that's a human ear. So only small enemies stumble once I block them with the shield. Big ones don't really care, they'll just keep attacking me. Dude. Okay. Fuck me. Let's make more progress before the episode's out. Christ. It's gonna be locked. No, okay. Oh fuck. Fencer Sharon. Behind me, in front of me, in front of me, behind me. Behind me, behind me. Let's get let's do a bridge fight. Hello? Ooh, what's she got on her head? Ooh, fancy! What happens if I block? Is she gonna attack through my block? Oh, she stumbles a little bit. Nice, okay. Okay. Come on, then. Come on, come on. Are you gonna attack? Are you, are you uh... Stamina. This person's quite strong. Ooh, 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 that's an interesting sword in her left hand. It's got like magic shit. Have you noticed her sword is turning into a whip? You're not breaking my shield block. Not today, woman. Oh god, once again the shield combat proving awesome. Ah! Ow! Fuck off. Fuck, man! Oh, woman. It is a whip sword. What the fuck was that? What? Is she whipping, like, powder in my face now? I didn't mean to do that. My bad. That's all I wanted to do the whole time. <laughs> that is such a powerful attack. Right, I'm gonna wanna... Oh, fuck off. At least I've got... If I didn't have a shield, her slowdown with that magic powder would really fuck you. I should probably just attack her. Oh, fucking hell! Fucking hell! Right, okay, let's not just attack her. Let's be smart about this. What? Stop! <laughs> Just please stop. Yes! Fuck you. One effigy or do I get more? One effigy. I've got enough. Right, I've got enough souls to level up now because I've got that soul item to use as well. So let's not be a dick here. Let's not waste souls. Well, I do want to commit to that thing, so let's just put two points in int. Bearer of the seek, lest this. Or one point for now, but yeah. Two more points in int. And that does up the damage of my magic, so win-win. Yeah. Is that big fuck gonna be here again? Yes, he is. Oh, how many souls you get for this big fuck? Let's just backstab him again, shall we? That didn't work. Fucking look at my damage. 
almost a thousand souls. I could go and buy two shards now. Not worth it. Right, that's that is committing to some severe shit. Oh fuck! What? 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 Say so, where? Well, what's with these seventeen thousand fucking armor of Dennis? Right, we are getting repeated like. We're, we're getting repeated fucking uh, invaders here. This is the second time I've had Dennis. I've had full on like three times. Right. This is, right, this shit's not going to stand. I don't get why the repeat like things, you know what I mean? I'm shielding. Okay, that's odd. Oh, fuck. No stamina. I've got no stamina. But what's, why am I getting two invaders on the same spot, even? Fuck. Oh my god, that is so annoying. All these invaders. But seriously, what's the deal? I had one invader right here and then a second different invader right here. Is it because I left the area and came back and you just... It's like scripted. You just get an invader every time you're here. Like, what's the deal? Let's get my shit back. And, uh... Am I correct in saying you don't get invaded if you're not human? I think somebody made that point, and I'm kind of... No, 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 it still happens. Alright. Uh, let's go Katana. I want to be faster. There he is. Um, excuse me? That is a little bit bullshit. Fucking hell. Right, there's a wall in the way. Okay, that's good, that's good. Fucking hell, his magic is so much stronger than mine. Look at that! Oh, armor of Dennis. Oh, that's literally pointless, isn't it? Right, come on. My shield's up, it would block some of the damage. I don't know where the other dude came from just there. What? <laughs> what? What the fuck? Has he got, like, multiple times stronger here? He's so much stronger than last time. I'm glad he rolled away, then. <laughs> oh! Right, those are orbs coming at me. Fuck off! Jesus Christ! This guy's probably better than a human enemy. He's rolling at the right fucking times. His shield... I can't get behind him no matter what. Oh, fuck off. Dude, this is this guy is so tough. 
what the fuck, man? Dude. He's blocking me even when he's not... Alright, okay. Let's stop complaining and kick his ass. Is it just me, or is that invader, is that Armour of Dennis the toughest enemy I have fought yet in this game? Every boss has been easier than that. I died more times on, like, the Serpent boss, but that's just because I had to learn the systems and methods of the fight. Do you know what I mean? Whereas in terms of raw skill and actually fighting an enemy, Armour of Dennis is the strongest enemy in this game that I've fought yet. And by the way, even my club wasn't stumbling armor of Dennis. Like, it wasn't breaking his poise. If that ain't proof, he's got a major upgrade since the first time I saw him. Nothing is proof. Because this has crazy poise break um, value on this club. Uh, I'm tempted to sack off the damage in favor of poise breaking. It, it makes a big difference. Like, such a big difference. Oh, right, okay, let's continue. Clearly that's gonna <laughs> fucking... That tor- that bull face is go- I'm glad I had my shield up. Fucking where did he come from? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Fuck! Fucking hell, man! Will this game give me a chance? Okay, this place is gonna be even harder, isn't it, than Earthen Peak? I can feel it already. Did you see how fast that suit of armor attacks you? There he is, you little bastard. I see you up there. <sighs> Fucking hell. You dangerous fuck. You missed. Fucking hell! Can I headshot him? Where's my fucking magic going? Where, where, where? This game is like kicking me square in the dick repeatedly. Like, I mean, actual physical pain here. Where the fuck are my spells vanishing to? He can arrow me, but my spells just refuse to exist. Fuck you, sir. Die, bitch. I will say I'm getting some nice souls here. Oh my god, right, okay. Let's, uh... Get my shield up. Okay, okay. Okay, new plan of attack for the episode. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm sweeping all the negative feelings I've got <laughs> about my own skill under the carpets, and we're only going to uh, either cry or enjoy myself. <laughs> Oh, no more negativity. Come on. Come on now. It's my own damn fault. Standing there taking attacks. Taking arrows to the face willingly. Uh, let's go down here before we go up. Oh. Okay. We've got two ways up. Hello. Ooh. Let me just... Hello there, learned scholar-looking guy with his eagle on his shoulder. Hello there. What? Who are you? Someone who's stressed out, man. Who, me? I'm sweating. Oh, I'm actually sweating. Magarold. What? Have a look at my wares. Oh, he's a farmer. He's got a... He's got like a Bristol... Stephen Merchant accent, but stronger. Look at my wares. Arr! I mean the treasure hunter, you see. Mm. Merchant on the side. Can you get his gear? 
A room of bang, looking for a find, following me instincts. I don't care what things worth. What matters is whether it grabs me. I love the accents in this game, dude. Do I enjoy what I do? Well, that's a good question. I didn't ask you. <laughs> We've been doing it for ages. Dude. If anyone anyone wants to know what accent this is, it's all of the country folk in the movie Hot Fuzz. Um, in that sort of little town where the police officer gets sent. It's this accent. A West Country accent, I believe they call it. Dude, look at that shit. Jester's cap robes. Dude. Dexterity requirements. Uh, decent resistances, no poise. Let's give that a read, though. A boldly coloured Jester's cap. A nice bit of fun to try on. Jester's... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Balls, man. Jesters are more than festival fixtures. Some have a second face hidden from a public view. Raises item discovery. Now that... I wonder how much by can I see? It's literally not on here, does it? so it doesn't tell you how much it will give you an uh, item discovery. Um... The problem is, if I take off my penal mask... I'm overweight immediately, like no matter what, even if I take a chest piece off, I'm still overweight. Which is a bit of a problem. Um. Oh fuck! Oh my god, they've, they've each got an effect. Uh, oh, dude, <laughs> I, can, I can put on some fucking tights and have less fall damage. That's incredible. Is this like the greatest set in the game? Number of souls acquired, that's like wearing my souls ring. That's like wearing the golden version of the item dis the item discovery ring. Fall damage is like my cat ring, and chest is... Nullifies foes critical hits. Now, the only game I've heard the word nullify in is Final Fantasy, and that means it completely negates something. So if you have, like... Poison nullify, it means you can't get poisoned. So does that mean I cannot get critical hits? Or does that just reduce the damage? That's ridiculous. Unless they are only small amounts, like a small amount of discovery, etc. I want to buy and wear the entire fucking set. Uh, this might make or break it. What's the fire resist like? Ah, hang on. Right, sorry. I mean, you can't see what your stats change to regardless. It, it's not changing, so you need to buy something before you can see what it is. Okay. So, the Ferocian outskirts. The territory of Feroz became lawless after the kingdom fell to war. Citizens became bandits and scattered to other lands. Interesting loadout. Uh, loadout. Okay. Rings for sale. Curse resistance. Interesting. One of several bite rings. Uh, hmm. Okay. Well, if I'm facing some googly fuckers or whatever, I'll remember that's there. Blossom, bombs, resin, da 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 da, coins. Okay. Oh, your carvings! And a branch of fucking yaw. That I can afford right now. Right, just because I know how limited they are in this game. I think some guy in the comments did say you get exactly enough in the entire game to to do every one of them. So if you miss one, then you miss one of the depetrifying statue moments. So I need to get and find and buy every single one of these. So let's be done with it. Um... He sells some nice saw. Ooh, he sells axes as well. Oh, fuck. Nah. I think just like your pyromancy, I'm going to say no to hexes in this playthrough. I've already committed to not going down the faith route. Um. God, right. Hang on. You, th thank you, sir. They, you're already one of my favorite merchants. 
You just stay right there. I might have to do some jig in here. Hold the phone. Am I fat rolling? I am! What what change have I made here? Um... I wasn't fat rolling once I put the night... Is this ring heavier than the one I had on? I bet it is. Which one did I have on? I had the poison ring on. It is! Oh, I went overweight from switching ring. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh, right, okay. Uh, I'm gonna take a five minute break, I'm gonna de-stress, I'm gonna get a drink, and then I'm gonna take a brief look at all my weight, and see if I can rejig some shit, because I'd quite like... I don't really want to look like a jester, I'll be honest, but I love the effects of those items, so I might be putting some jester shit on. So, uh, so yeah, I'll be right back. Right, I'm back, I've got a delicious beverage, and I'm just looking at my gear. Um, I've decided that that jester mask, ridiculous and hilarious though it looks, it's almost necessary because in a blind playthrough I want to get as many items and things as possible, including gear. And at least in the first game, item discovery was so important, I used that ring pretty much exclusively. Um, the problem, the problem is I'm using a very heavy weapon and a shield and another weapon. And my mask gives me a quip load, so as soon as I take this off and put your jester mask on, I'm thousands of kilograms or whatever overweight. So, uh, let's take it off and just see where we're at, because I've got some heavy legs on that I can remove. Uh, hang on, what? That is a quip load, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, I've suddenly realized I think the weight of that mask is out use like even though it equates your it, learn to speak and enunciate your words even though um, you get what I'm saying the, the weight is is not worth it because even if I take it off and lose the equip load I'm much much less uh, heavy I go down to 64 percent let's just buy it You've quit. I will click the incense option soon, don't worry. Dude. Right, I'd love to see... And that's another thing, if these are... I can't compare right now, but if these fire resists are quite good, I might want to buy these just for your fire resist. Cheers. I'm half surprised it doesn't sell a fire resist ring. Uh, I'm sure we'll get one far too late in this area. Right, okay. Right, I'm... Right, okay. Just... I don't have to worry about the others for now, but I'm underweight. With that on. <laughs> it's like I've got a pair of legs coming out of my head. Oh my god, that looks... Uh... This wasn't what the first invader was wearing, is it? What was the first invader called? Was it a jester? And I didn't realise at the time. I don't think it was. But that looks... That looks almost intimidating. That's not a fun jester, that's like a terrifying jester. That's hilarious. Does it wobble? Do they wobble when you move? They do slightly. Oh my god. I've got a wobbling... <laughs> oh yeah! Okay, well. Important moment. What the fuck? Is my item discovery yet? Uh, I'll just I'll keep it on because I, even if it's a small amount, like ten percent item discovery increase, it's still worth it. So I will keep it on. So out of all these, I'm least precious about the fall damage because I can equip a ring if I need to fall. But I'd like the gloves. Can you imagine that plus the ring? Now you're talking. It's only 2,300. Um, cool. Right, incense. What? Say what? Lower required attributes for which spell? Uh, does he just do that as a thing, as a free service? There's no cost there. 
There's good iron in these parts. An old king even used it to build a castle. But the fuel was too heavy. And it slowly sank into the ground. Huh. Or spiked it from the earth. Oh. And the place turned into this. At least, that's what I've been told. Not bad story, eh? Well, I appreciate your custom, sir. Anything else I need to know? The Hulking Blue Sword. Gav, uh, Gav, no, um... I got a feeling it's a fake. Ben Hart, that's it. I didn't disappoint him, so I just sort of talked to Rain then. Let me just say, there are lots of legendary swords out there. Hmm. I did say I wanted that guy's blue sword, but, uh, interesting. Have you heard of the shrine on the eastern edge of Drang Lake? The stone, yes. Built to honor the dragons, they say. <sighs> if only I knew how to get oh. there. I'd, I'd go and I'd kill it for good. He must be talking about some other thing. I thought it was one about that stone on the east edge of Medjula that you can pray to or whatever. I'm mainly a treasure hunter, you see. Many a merchant on the side. On the side? <laughs> Looking for a fight, following me instincts. I don't care what things worth. What matters is whether it grabs me. Do I enjoy what I do? Well, that's a good question. I suppose I must. I I think he's repeating himself now, is he? There's good iron in these parts. Yes, he is. Okay. Least. Another example of that... Fucking hell, shut up, man! <laughs> Another example of that accent is the... Some of the some of the townsfolk in Robin Hood. Robin, Robin of Loxley, whatever the fuck it is. Uh, the older film with Kevin Costner. Um, some of the... Little John and his wife have that accent. Where's, where, where's your husband? Died last winter. That's that's this a same exact accent. <laughs> right, okay, let's go up here first. Dude. Hello? Poison? Okay. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Hello. Ah. I just heard a noise. Right, there's a ballista there. Let's get on the right side of the ballista. Can I shoot the wall? Is that going to reveal a thing? Um, how do you... Okay. Fire arrow. Am I using my own arrows to do this? Oh, hang on, hang on, just in case, just in case, just in case. Yeah! <laughs> Is he still alive? Right, okay. Well, that's what you get, okay? What, does he not give a fuck? Hey, if he's gonna make it easy, why not? Ah! Fucking Jack! Fucking hell, man! Ah. Oh, these guys look slightly different to the ones outside. That's right, you're scared of me now, aren't you? Oh! I can't decide if I look better or worse with this on. The the other, the penal mask I was wearing wasn't exactly a great looking piece of armor. Actually, I didn't really like it. Um, oh, this is the same way up. Gotcha. I must be able to turn that off somehow. Hmm. No hidden walls. Okay. I wonder if that illusory wall only is clickable if you shoot it with an arrow first. But yeah, I wasn't a fan of the penal mask looking thing. This is kind of equally weird. Uh, 
Oh god, have we got another fucking moment? What are the, the silver knights? I think from the first game, the ones that just fire up massive arrows. I get it. It's these. It's the same difficulty. Ow! Oh god. In thy chest. This is something I never did in the first game, though. Is cheese my way with distant magic? Mmm. Uh, I'm tempted to. Uh, am I a dick for wanting to go human? Oh, sh hang on. Sorry, there's there's actual shit there. There's loot. Um. Was there something I didn't see? Oh. Hang on, where the fuck? Oh, right, I just didn't go this way. <laughs> oh, fuck yes. Well, let's commit. I do need to get in range before I can spell them in the distance. Fuck it. I killed two uh, phantoms. And I might as well utilize their effigies and shit. Dude, it's like a blast furnace. It's like the furnace of the gods. Oh shit. Right, I can jump over to these things, which is worrying. Didn't mean to do that. Ow. Be gone with you. Hello there. Oh, they, they jog pretty quick. Where are they coming from? I can't break their poise, but they can't break mine either. Okay. Uh, right, we've got some jumping to be doing here, maybe. Maybe, not really. Oh, fuck that. Fuck that. Oh, God. Let's break out the old magic. Can I push him off? Oh, fucking hell! Even ready and trained on the motherfucker, I was too slow to press the button. <laughs> Fuck off, would you? Right, uh... I can't lock on, which is weird. And there's some weird effects going on here. Can I just shoot that fucker? Hmm. Uh, hang on. I can't... Right. Okay, I can't climb on there without falling first. Let's go hit a lever. Oh, right. I see. We can go down there. Illusory walls. Something tells me if I open this, fire is going to explode <laughs> out and kill my ass. I can even see the fire behind there. There's no way I'm opening that just yet. I did not see that before. Okay. Right. Well, we'll go this way first, I, th I think. That climbs up to there. And that goes nowhere. Hmm. Oh, fuck! Oh my god, I didn't see the gap. Oh, god. I 
mashing the button so you can hear it. Okay, hello there, trap chest, possibly. Don't eat me. Don't do it. Life ring plus one and a twinkling titanite, dude. I mean, you know. How much does it give you? Hang on. An extra 30 over the other one. Ech. Ech. Right. Okay. So I'm stuck here now. Okay, let's go back. Oh! I wasn't born fucking yesterday. I'm not opening that door. Okay. Fucking hell, have you seen the way they like tip tippy toe towards you? That's what I look like when I really, really need a piss and I'm on the way to the bathroom in a hurry. <sighs> it's like all of these guys need strongly need a piss. I've only got two flasks left, I'm trying to save them. Oh, is this gonna Oh no, okay, right, I see it's like a a fixed um forgotten what Americans call them. The 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 something beginning with T. Anyway, I've got some loot there, got a fog door. That's not gonna be a boss. Uh, okay. Hmm. Loot over there as well. Oh shit. Okay. Dude, this... I'm liking this area. This is a cool level design. I can see a ladder from th from that pl edge that goes up there. And then inevitably down there. And a Ferris lockstone and a chest. What the fuck? Okay, I may have forgotten that casting a spell steps you forward. Like a basic bitch. Oh fuck off. Oh god, no. Oh my god, no. Right, okay. At the very least, there hopefully isn't an invader. That's the big problem. If I've got to find another, another invader again. <laughs> Fucking Jesus. No! Hit him! Hit him! Hit the fucker! I've got no- No! I, uh, uh, uh. Ah! Run! Move! I'm- I'm- I'm hold- Clicking and hold- <laughs> I'm clicking- I'm clicking and holding the- the- the key to sprint and he just won't move. I don't know why. Right. Goodbye, souls. Goodbye, humanity. Ah, oh, okay. At least I can just kill him now. I reckon one power attack will kill these guys two-handed. Oh, it is a one-shot kill. Right. Ooh, nice. Three great arrows. Mm, I think the item discovery jester helmet's already coming in handy. Right, come at me. See if I give a fuck. See if me and my gigantic club give a fuck. I'm already... Look at the fucking souls you get for these guys. Did I lose more than I thought? think I lost? I've got 7,000 souls by killing like three of these guys. And I previously killed like seven of them. Um. Well, I'd be a dick to not... 
you know, to repeat the same mistakes. So let's spend them. Sir, I'd like your pants or whatever you want to sell me. Well? I'd like to get in your pants. Critical hits. Right, if I give a fuck about any of these, it's souls. So let's buy that. Yeesh. Look at the fucking pants. They look hilarious. I'm gonna buy them. I might not wear the pants, they, they look so silly. Cheers. But let's have a quick look at, uh, at some shit here. And something I didn't look at was your fire resist. That's important in this area. I was wearing the penal mask. Oh, I'm losing fire resist. Mm. Gloves. Yeah. 2.1 weight. Gesticles is slightly heavy, but I'm still not fat rolling. Same fire resist, and I get more souls. Thank you. That's going straight on. So I'm getting more items and more souls. And more souls. I like to think wearing these three things that are in increasing items and soul shit is making up for the fact that I'm dying and losing my souls by tossing myself in the lava. Uh, let's just club this fool. Like the king of the seals. Fuck you. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> oh my god. You've got to admit, it's satisfying just, like, clubbing them. Much satisfaction to be had. That's right, bitch. <sighs> okay, I know what to farm to get souls. Bloody hell, this is a jump up. I'm getting way more in this area. Right, okay. Running attack. Slam, bitch. Oh, he didn't kill him. Shit. My bad. No! What is my guy doing? What is he doing? Why is he walking onto edges? Fuck. Right, just some more getting shot. Let's dodge and roll and heal. <gasps> oh, this fucking game. Okay, I need to, uh... Hang on, am I getting shot at? Okay. Let us check between shots where I'm standing. I can do one more. Oh, fuck. Why do they have to in introduce the, uh, the step forward with every spell cast? <gasps> oh. oh, that's annoyingly close. Calm down, sir. There you go. Right, okay. 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 I'm guessing there's a, there's a cranky boy which will tip it back towards this ledge. But I might as well just uh, go ahead and do one of these. <gasps> Red leech torches or something. I saw that. I saw it. I saw it. Right, okay, let's just let's not panic. There you go. Use the thing as, as cover. Um. There's the cranky boy, but I want to run and jump over there. And then we'll we'll dodge and weave. Oh, no, 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 bad. Roll. Roll! 
and again, and again, just kill, kill one of them. I didn't realize they were bigger, tough, tougher fuckers. Oh, these are way stronger and bigger. Look at them. You fire one more on me, that'll be great. Thank you. Run and slam. I just, okay, just miss my attack, why don't I? Okay. Dude, look at that fucking weapon. Get down on the floor, please. Thank you. In the crotch! <laughs> okay. No need to fear any guy that I can smash the balls off of. Thank you. Dude. Yeah, okay. I didn't see that these were far bigger and tougher. But it's all good. Now, I did see a... Did I or did I not see the top of a ladder on here? I'm pretty sure I did, unless it was somewhere else. Um, okay, I'm 99% sure when I last looked at the top of this place, there was a ladder thing on the top left edge of it, wasn't there? Hmm. Huh. Right, there's no way this is going to be a boss, so let's just defog the area. What? No! Um, right, I, I haven't been human for long enough to know if there's, if there's gonna be like a, um, a Lucatiel summon sign. So, either I home bone out of here. Very cool visual. Fucking hell, look at that thing. Smelter demon. Smelter demon. Isn't that a boss in the first game? Or am I thinking of the Taurus demon or something? Okay. Yeah, I'm not comfortable facing a proper boss like that until I'm sh certain, okay? Certain that there's no summon sign. I haven't been human everywhere long enough to see if Lucatiel's somewhere. Jesus Christ, right, I've cleared most of those things. Let's just, uh, oh god, I've got to kill these again. Um, right. No problem. My problem is I lost like 14,000 souls or some shit. Oh god. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Come at me. I did not realize... Oh, fucking hell! Okay. <sighs> okay, okay, we're back. Fucking look at my souls! Jesus Christ, right, I'm in a- I've got a problem here. Um, shield's coming out, just in case that helps. Uh, I need to bone out of here once I grab my souls, but I don't- I, I think it's quite a second or two before you actually get out. Um, but if I can pull this off, I'm even gonna put on defensive shit. Defensive ring. That one. This is gonna be a, pr a problem. Um. Okay, um, game plan. Let's let's go into this with a plan. Game plan. Loot my souls, like, before anything. Because I need- I can die and I can still get everything back again. And maybe shield up. It depends where my souls are. Thirty thousand souls. Okay. Yes, I did a good, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, <sighs> oh, the adrenaline. The heart's beating. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. <sighs> Let's just get to a safe place. <laughs> Fucking hell. I've got to say, that that's possibly the coolest looking boss yet. 
I might have to Google Smelter Demon at some point once I've defeated him. Because um, I want to see if that's got any relation to the first game. I know we had Capra Demon and Taurus Demon. I don't think we had a Smelter Demon in the first game. But we might have. But this, this looks like an armoured version of all your demons from the first game. Hmm. Anyway, let's level up int to 16 like I wanted to. Bearer of the seek, seek lest. Yep, okay. I've got another branch, by the way. So I can go do that one down that ramp into No Man's Wharf or whatever. Anyway, 16, thank you. I don't think there's anything else I need. Boss weapons, etc. with strayed. You know what, should I, should I have a quick check before I go back down to Smelter Demon Land? Yeah. Let's do that, because I don't want to spend all these souls and then... To buy a boss weapon it costs like 12,000 or some shit. There might be something I want. So let's go check. Um, Strayed Cell, oh, thank god for that. Please tell me he's just stood here. And that these guys don't just attack you. Be, be chill. Be cool. Oh, there he is. Hello. Well, this is a most peculiar soul. Very cool. Oh. Ah. I must have got a, the, the Serpent's Woman's soul. Okay. Trade, is that it? Yeah, that's it. Oh, Myth of the Baleful Queen's Soul. That's added a bent blade. Dagger. Okay, dagger forged from the soul of that serpent woman. Coated with a potent poison. Ah, so it's got poison built in. Mytha was the fairest queen in the land until something unhinged her. Was it the poison found deep within the earth or the passion that consumed her heart? Hmm. Uh, right, let's give these a proper read, because last time I briefly looked at them with the goal of checking them out later, and I never did. Pursuer's Ultra Great Sword. I can have that motherfucker's sword. That was one hell of a great sword. The Ultra Great Sword of the Pursuer, known as the mightiest of the straight swords. It demands great str 30 strength. I think I could splash out to that. I'm only like four points away from that. Da, 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 da. The pursuer hunts down those branded by the curse, as if each undead soul that he claims will atone one of his sins. Warped sword, a curved sword forged from the soul of the flexile sentry. Once straight, it is now bent to reflect its warped owner. The sentry crammed inmates of the overflowing Bastille onto a rickety ship and cast them out to the open sea. The majority of them drowned or starved, but a few hardy survivors made land to the south and imparted their knowledge of sorcery to the people there. Uh, curved sword. Let's just see what they all are first. So we've got a dagger, ultra sword, curved sword, curved great sword, great axe, hammer, spear. Some of these look really interesting. Halberd. I do love me a good halberd. Dragon Rider's halberd. Okay. This this is making a lot of sense why you don't get their weapon as a drop when you kill them. It's because you get it now, later. Uh, that's two different halberds. Um, let's just keep looking. Uh, Reaper. What the fuck? That's a weapon type. I'm guessing that's got a scythe moveset. Grim Reaper, Lance, Twin Blade, Bow, Crossbow, and a Great Shield, and another one. Okay. Dude, Twin Blade. That's an even cooler version of Darth Maul's lightsaber. Um, King Vendrick's Royal Guard. So I'm guessing that, that and the Halberd are both Dragon Rider. Right, yeah, okay. Okay. Well, let's give them their due uh, diligence. Let's actually read them. 
Twin blades are wielded with an unusual technique. This one strikes hard, but is very heavy. I can wield that right now. Demands great skill, and thus... Okay. Chariot Lance. This is from the Chariot, motherfucker. Lance, forward from the soul... Its cross-shaped blade causes bleeding. Okay. So we've got a poison and we've got a bleed so far. Yeah. The perverse design of this spear mirrors the chariot from which it came, a merciless creation that endlessly tortured the undead. Bone Scythe. This is from the Covetous Demon. That's the slug. Scythe. The curved spine of the slug is hard as rock. Rather than slicing through flesh, this weapon seems to grind it apart. Oh, a serrated scythe. That thing that ended up as a monstrous fiend... What was it to begin with, and why did it never leave the Queen? Perhaps it was entranced by some perversion of love. Roaring Halbert and Dragon Rider's Halbert. Okay, this is from your Skeleton Lords. Interesting looking Halbert. Uh, Halbert fought... Imbued with the power of dark. Oh shit. The unsettling skull carved into this Halbert recalls the final moments of the Skeleton Lord from whom it was created. Dragon Rider Halberd, a highly versatile weapon that can slash, sweep, and thrust with when wield did. I can't I can't read. I'm stupid. When wielded nimbly, and it is also imbued with magic. Demands a great skill of its wielder, and thus serve to test the worthiness of right. Gargoyle Bident. Like a trident, but two? It's got okay, it's a, it's a two-pronged fork. Okay. This is from the roof gargoyles. Hmm, gargoyles are said to be uh, to guard castles and forts from ill fortune, and they have appeared in many forms in the great lands throughout history. Some of them are so meticulously crafted that they look as if they might come to life. <laughs> Hello. Barbed club again from the flexile sentry. Uh, see, that's a hammer. If that was a great hammer, I would sincerely consider it and, and replace my large club. Because I, I don't really like the aesthetic of a simple large club. I, I'd much prefer like a barbed thing or a hammer. But that's just a smaller club, it looks like. The sentry crammed in... Uh, okay, yeah, read that already. Giant stone axe. This is from The Last Giant. This weapon resembles a primitive stone tool, but it's quite powerful owing to its immense size. King Vendrick disappeared as of the war with the giants reached its ferocious peak, leaving his castle... That word is going off the edge of the box boundary. Some swear that upon hearing the news, the Queen's face remained as still as her portrait. So the Queen didn't give no fucks about King Vendrick. Okay. And this is from the Flex Out Century again, the curved sword. That l large curved sword sounds very interesting to me. There's something unsettling and at the same time beautiful about its long curved blade. The sentry crammed... that's the same... okay. Warp sword... same description. Right, okay, so we've got... Once again, dagger... Greatsword. I'm out of all of these, I'm leaning towards the great ultra greatsword the most. Damage isn't too great though. Dagger, ultra greatsword, curved sword, great hammer, spear, halberd. I'm leaning away from halberds this playthrough, actually. Lance Twin Blade. Okay, what about spells? No, that's it. Okay. Well, it costs fuck all souls, so that's irrelevant. Is there anything I want here and now? I don't think there is. Um, I'm going to save them for now, and... All right, stop complaining. Um, I'm, I want to try like a curved sword and an ultra curved sword before I buy a boss version of those things. And should we go use that thing right now? The branch of yours, since I've got it. I don't really see why not. Um, let's level up one more time. Of the seek, seek, lest this and I tell you what, so many different things are requiring 30 strength both to power stance and some weapons just to wield them, so I'm gonna go to 30 strength. Now that I've got my 16 int. 
Nice. 28. Ooh, we're close. Um, anything else? Souls items? Uh, not enough. Right. I think I can fast travel close to that thing down there. The thing should be here. Unless, it's, unless I'm going forwards accidentally. Should be some googly fuckers. Thank you. Fuck! Oh my god. I'm forgetting how tough enemies are. Okay. Oh. Right, okay, I'm a dick. Uh, I must have done this one already. Okay. Okay. Fine with me. Well, how long have I been going? Three oh, fucking hell, three hours. Shit, man. Right, uh, since I've technically rested, what I'll do is I'll jump, cut forward to where we were. Uh, yeah, I'll jump, cut forward to outside the fog down, then we'll clear more of the area. Okay. Cancel the jump cut forward. Uh, the second half of your jump cut will come later, but I thought this might be destructible, um, and it's not. But... I didn't instantly die either. Do you reckon I can grab this? At near light speeds. I don't have anything to lose. I reckon I get this. Ooh, I got it! <laughs> I got it, but I instantly died. Iron key, okay. Interesting, let's give that a read. First key I've had in quite a while, by the way. Opens the iron door of the iron keep. Key to the iron door of the iron keep. The old iron king's castle sunk into a lake of fire, weighed down by the castle's iron, and the burden of the king's conceit. Over the ages, the iron was stripped from the castle by opportunistic passers-by. Okay, so all the iron's gone except the door. Oh no, the iron door too must be somewhere far, far away. What? Key to the iron door of the iron keep, but now then it says the iron door is somewhere far, far away. Alright, okay. If it's not in the land of fire, I'll grab my... 5,000 souls, and then we'll continue our jump cut backwards. Uh. Fuck off, would ya? Oh, can I learn to play? <gasps> Fuck! Okay, multiple emotions all shot through me then, within about a three second period. Ultimate fear from this fucker appearing. Ultimate excitement at getting another katana. Um, and I'm excited because that washing pole, pole um, katana is longer, it, so it might not power stance with the other katana, and I think it uses more stamina with each swing. So it's almost like a different kind of weapon. But I've just got a third fucking katana. Oh, fuck yes. Black steel katana. Wielded by Alon Knights, one of the sturdiest types of katana, preferred by masters. Uh, da, 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 of the quick draw. Preferred by masters of the quick draw. Is that that technique where it's in its holster? I don't know what it's called, but you know what I mean? Uh, sheath, that's the word. Where it's in its sheath and you, you attack from, from the sheath. So I've seen that as a move before. That must be a quick draw. In the heyday of his land, the old Iron King fancied entertaining dubious and eccentric guests from faraway lands. Most of them were charlatans. But among the riffraff was an unusual knight from the Far East. He trained the Iron King's men in the sword, in obese... obeisance to his new yore. That, that's a made-up word. Obeying... in the obeying on his, of his new lord. Okay. Well... 
Okay, I might as well do it right now. Can I... Ignore the washing pole one just for now. Can I put on both a power stance? I'm right here. Fuck! What do I need? It must be fucking... Great. Oh, I need 25 decks. Fucking hell. It comes with a scaling, but it comes with a really low damage. And it's true to say, isn't it, you need 1.5 times the value of both strength and dex, so I need, like, half of 25... Let me know in the comments if I'm right. I need, like, 1.5 times that, so I don't think I'm ever going to get that. Uh, half of 25 is 12.5. 12.5 added to that is 37. I need 37.5, uh, 38 decks. I doubt I'm going to get that in this playthrough. So I won't be able to dual wield that. But I'm only like one or two decks away from being able to two hand it on its own. Well, I'll remember that I've got it. Let's just say that. And let's get back to it. Fuck! Oh my god, you dangerous fuck. Die with your awesome lightning sword. Right, I'm back again. I'm alive. We're just saying some serious shit. I tell you what, look at my fucking souls just by getting back here. Let's, uh... I mean, it's getting to be silly now because... I'm getting more souls than I'm comfortable losing, but when I leave to go spend them, I then have to kill my way back here, at which point I've got tens of thousands of souls again. So it's it's self-defeating to keep leaving until they permanently disappear. <laughs> kind of weird. But you know what? Let's go human. And we'll continue to loot everywhere, etc. But Summon sign. Oh my god. Oh, I fucking... Oh, thank God I didn't kill the boss. I just had something in my heart and soul telling me, like... Because I, I hadn't been human for all of this shit, so I would have missed the summon signs. Oh, thank God. Oh, God, that thing's going to kill Luca Teal with, like, one fucking swipe. Oh, my God. Um... I do do a lot of damage though, so if I can dodge his triple swipe together, we can probably kill the fucker quite easy. Um, right, I will say this point as well for people who are disappointed with the lost center fight. I do plan on doing all these summon fights um, with New Game Plus by the end of this playthrough. I don't know if I'm going to do it soon or at the end of the playthrough, but. I do intend to have a solo attempt at all these bosses that I'm summoning for. So don't worry if you if you want to see me duke it out one on one, it will happen. Um Right, shield out. I'm gonna jump over to there. Um oh god, do we try and do this this episode? I think we do. It's gonna be a long one though. We're on three hours, 20 minutes. Edited, that's probably three hours or three, 310. Right, okay. Shield up, fuck. Please don't collapse, please don't collapse. Petrified dragon bone. That sounds v like a weapon or a very useful item. Maybe a uh, upgrade item? There, it is! Oh, we've got three of them. Right, I'm guessing that's to upgrade dragon weapons. Cool. And the illusory walls. I've already killed the two fuckers here. And let's use the Pharos Luckstone. Um, I know you can destroy chests, but one swipe should be okay. Okay. It's not a monster. Zweihander? Hey, officially, that's that's that was a good sword I never used in the uh, in the first game. Ultra greatsword. That's more damage than the pursuer's greatsword. 
shit, strength scaling, that was D. Huh. That's odd that it has such a shit strength scaling, but it has a, such a high strength requirement. Right, I've got like two lockstones, so hey, do it. Please don't be another little poison pool. It's just water this, uh, this it's just water this time, it's not poison. Um. Right, I don't know what to make of this. That's the second Faris Loxton I've wasted on a liquid. Like, what's the deal? What's the deal with the water? Um. Can you do something with these little pools? First the pool of poison, now the pool of water. Can I fill a thing or use a thing? Or does it, like, cle clean me of, like, shit? Let's say I'm covered in poison, can I go in water and it would, it would clean me? Or something? It's gotta have some fucking use. Or maybe if I'm on fire, it would put me out by going in here. Um, but then what's the, the point, because there's nothing setting me on fire, so... I guess we'll learn, but I've got a... I know where a patch of water is, should I need, need it in the future. Which can only be a good thing. Right, we're full health. You've got the door over there. Still refusing to go in. Because that'll just fucking explode and kill you. I can bring the bridge back down here. Oh god. We had another chest down on fire area down there. Um, I guess we're going to do something major to this area, like change the lava or the fire or raise or lower the fire or something. I think we should just do the Lucateal boss. Hang on, is there something down there? There is, there's a guy down there, but that's neither here nor there. Let's bring out your club. Um, it is what it is. It, it is what it is. It's a lot of souls to, to lose, but let's just do this. Uh, you can home bone out if she dies, and you can die if she dies, and you can try again. Um, I'm tempted to die if you see what I mean rather than waste one of my two bones it's now or never look at teal it's you and me and destiny bring it on there's no focus to, to hurt her before the boss room this time let's kill this fool hello again I'm gonna try and get behind the fucker and just go ape shit. Like slams. Uh yeah. Oh fucking hell, he's weak. Right, my club isn't strong against him. Okay, he's on fire. Um, right, stamina. He is so high health. I might do light attacks here. I don't mind him being on me actually, because it's so he's not attacking her. No, look at Teal's getting hammered. She's got more health than she did against the Flexile Sentry. Sorry, um, the Lost Sinner. <sighs> I'm nearly dying here myself. Ow! Heal again, real fast. So he can explode with fire, got it. Heal again, I'm not taking any chances. She's doing the damage for me. 
Yep. Oh, I saw that coming. I've got this. Two. Three. Back off. And then I've got it. I've got it. Fuck you! Yes, Luca Tealis, you and me and destiny! Yes! Smelt a demon soul and our million souls. Okay. Dude, it is literally orders of magnitude easier with a summon. Like, it, it's not just a little bit easier. We're, we're talking full-blown, like, ten times easier sort of a deal. Because I don't have to worry about him attacking me, you know? And I'm sorry. Luca Teal, did she or did she not have way more health slash defense against this guy than she did against the Lost Senna? The Lost Senna destroyed Luca Teal in like three attacks. Granted, she was on half health <laughs> um, before I even entered the boss fight, but still, she held her own there. Much, much better. Jesus Christ. What the fuck is with this camera? Oh my god. Right, let's not die. Okay, what's the deal? What's going on? That's the way back. Let's just go forwards. 50,000 souls. We're not wasting this shit. Um, s s shield up. I had to go onto the life gems there, though, because I'm out of... Uh, I'm out of flasks. Shield up, because I don't want to die now. I want to rest somewhere, and then find Luca Teal somewhere. Let's rest. <laughs> Let's rest. Before anything else. <sighs> We're safe, and we've got a fire. Is she here somewhere? Trap. Poor scene shield and a five butterflies. Dude, I, I haven't needed to light my torch anywhere yet. It's all nice and brightly lit. Was that poor scene thing? Or poor chini thing? We'll find poor scene, whatever the fuck that was, somewhere else. Like later on. Let's quickly check, make sure Luke Tail ain't around here. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm not scared of you no more. You ain't shit, sir. Oh my god, his health is crazy high. What the fuck? Why is his health so fucking high? Let's do light attacks against this thing. Is this club, like, weak against... Armored enemies or something. Let's break out the uh, katana. I'm not going to lock on either. Right. Oh, that's even worse. Oh my god. Right. He's got a fucking upgrade. Um, club's coming back out. I don't want to pull that fucker out there. Even his armor's getting, like, bigger. I don't want to take this guy for granted. He's like my bitch, but at the same time, you know what I'm saying, he's, he's, he's fucking clearly tougher. <laughs> got him down to half health, that's fine. I'll be on point, I've got a nice lovely open room to, to dodge his magic attack when he does it. I, I, whoa, you fast fuck. I might as well do my power attack, because my light attack is just as slow. <sighs> yeah, worth it.
Oh, look at him. Has he always been able to... No. Back. No, no. Left, right, left, right. Just, just, just. All, I'm pressing all sorts of buttons. All sorts of buttons. All sorts of buttons. Come on, attack me. Very good. I don't care that I'm cursed. Being cursed ain't shit. Fuck you. First time, bitch. Ring of Blades plus one. I'm, I'm actually using that, am I not? I am not. <laughs> right, I don't need the steel protection anymore. I can't even remember why I put that on. Um, right, I, it was the souls I had on before, didn't it? Um, he gave me attack plus one, I'm guessing. Can I see... It's the third one down. It's 416 is my damage right now without either ring. 436 or 451. So you're looking at a, an increase of... 40... 35... 35... Yeah, 35. Which is... 10% is 41, so it's less than 10%. It's like 8% damage bonus for the upgraded ring. I think I'd prefer to just have more souls, honestly. It's already enough damage. But thanks for that anyway. Let's get the fuck out of here and spend some serious soulage. I, uh, I guess we should just level up. But with so many souls, I feel like I should be, sp like, buying some boss weapons or something unique with it. That's the most souls I've had yet. I fucking shit. I don't want to die here. I have rested here, so if I die, I'm right here. But let's kill this fucker. Whoop. Hang on. Calm down. Calm down. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, no. We're not. No. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Next time. Next time. I've been going long enough. Three hours thirty. I don't want to spend those um, pebbles, so I've got a couple of bits to do still. I do have sixteen ints now. So how about for a start, attune spells? I can put on the better ones, um, those ones. Now, I could put the ring on to get a third slot, but honestly, I'm happy with just two spells. I'd rather have more souls. <laughs> So, question is, which should I replace? 30 weak things, and they are getting increasingly weak against some of the tougher, like, knights and stuff. Or the 15 stronger ones. I'm tempted to just go as strong as possible, so will I replace my weak ones? The logic being I'll only use magic for obviously annoying ranged enemies, but also tough things, so I want as much damage as possible. You know, if I need more uses, I can always just pop one of the flower things or whatever and get more spell uses. Okay. Well, let's just get to 30 strength, so that's... Uh, yeah, so that's forever done. And I've still got fucking 30,000 souls. Bloody hell. Um, now, just to be clear, what did I need 30 strength for? It's not that. Um... I think one of the boss weapons needed 30 strength, didn't it? Hmm. I've actually completely forgotten. I know something needed 30 strength. Maybe one of the big swords. 28. Maybe it was just power stancing. But either way, I got the 30 strength I always wanted. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Look at my stats. I'd like to get to 25 decks just so I can use that black katana if I wanted it. Yeah, fuck it. Why not? Bearer of the Se seek lest this. It's just more damage, isn't it? At the end of the day, strength and decks. Fuck it. I'm thinking 16 might be the ceiling that I take in in this playthrough, because that's enough for the stronger spell, and I'm doing enough magic damage to be happy. 
Oh shit. Nope. Uh, let's talk to her. Anything new to say? There, see, see, lest this... For when the undead dies, no. not all undead... No. Okay. Well, um, let's round out the episode by inspecting my awesome improved stats. Uh, yeah. I'm ha oh, I'm so tempted to buy the claw from whoever the fuck was selling it and equip two claws and power sense them both. How expensive are they? Uh times these are Sorry, who sold somebody was selling a cheap, easy claw. Um I knew Neither of those guys. Uh Have you got a claw for me? Yes. 50, and it's nice and cheap. Yes. Right, if power stancing two things literally makes you Wolverine. Cheers for that. <laughs> suddenly, I'm going to have a new direction in this game. Let's just take off all my weight. Okay. Uh, similar damage, similar shit. Really? Let's put those under the main hand. Mannequin one in the left hand. Fucking hell. This is just... This is some seriously awesome shit. Come on. Just a clown face, two claws. Oh, no, I'm... I'm right, okay. Again, it's not power stancing it. I mean, you can sort of just, you can fake your your way just by wielding both and attacking separately with both. But it's just, you know what I mean? It's just two-handing the left weapon. So can somebody let me know in the comments um, why power stancing doesn't seem to be a thing? Like, I know it doesn't have to be identical weapons or even two weapons of the same kind. You can... You can power stance, I think, like a curved sword with a straight sword, in, you know, etc. But you'd figure two claw weapons, like, would power stance into a thing. They're both claw, both slash. I definitely have the stat requirement for both of them. Or do I? Hang on. 18 decks. Oh god, no I don't. Fuck. No wonder. <laughs> It's a fucking pain, the high requirement weapons, like power stance in them. So that's 18 plus 9, that's 27, isn't it? Yeah, 27 decks. And I have 25 decks. <laughs> um, okay. Never mind. Can I fucking power stance something, please? Like, everything's too high, too good, too strong. The only thing I've fucking power stance so far is two fucking daggers, because they're so weak and pathetic. I didn't even think of, about the dex value on these. Because half of the strength is 20, so that's 30 strength needed to do these. But 14 dex is 7. 7 plus 21. Oh, I can't... I think people told me you still got to use the left attack to do power stance attack uh, thing. I mean, talk about slam-tastic. I mean, that's that's really good for like a boss or just a single enemy. Jesus. Uh, what's the poise break of two slamming power stance halberds? 35 poise break each. Does that add together uniformly to make 70 poise break? Um. Hmm. Somebody let me know in the comments, because if that is the case, then that slam attack is more poise break damage than my club, which is saying something. Um, right, I can't end the episode and not try these out on a motherfucker. 
this this might just invalidate all my club usage. Because I'm going to keep in mind here that they're not upgraded nearly as much as my club. Um, in fact, one of them isn't upgraded at all. But if this damage can even remotely come fucking close to the club, I'll be back on board the halberd train if you get what I am saying. It's not the flashiest moveset, but that is one fucking hell of a slam. So, this is not upgraded. I'm half tempted for lols. If this is good to put a, an infusion on these, keep the club normal. Um, maybe keep your katanas normal, but put like fire or dark on these or some shit. Hello. Um. Okay, whoa. It's not upgraded damage, keep that in mind, keep that in mind. Hmm. And I might not have been hitting them with the ends of the weapon, which is more damage. Uh, I'll try the light attack slams. In fact, what's the running attack like? It's just a normal, it's not a power stance attack, is it? That's fine. Um, okay. Let's try normal slams. I can see uh, it, when these are both plus six damage. Oh fuck, well now, I, I mean now's the test. Fucking hell. See, ooh right, that was less damage because of the... I hit him with the wooden pit of the weapon. That's full damage, okay. Um, I want the regular fuck to attack me, if possible. Nope, no, 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 no. No, fuck! I'm trying to do the roll attack. <laughs> that didn't fucking work. Alright. Is the other one coming at me? Nope, no it's not. No it's not. Fuck, I'm not... Right, the lock on is fucking me. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Don't die. Fuck. I'm not even power stancing anymore. There we go. Let's try that. Um, does a jumping attack... I can't remember if... No, it's not. That's just a regular left-hand attack, isn't it? Why well, is it not attacking me? Fuck off. Oh, fuck off. Four nine nine. Uh, hang on, do one on him. Hang on. <sighs> Fucking hell. Four ninety. Okay, I'm gonna rest at the fire. I'll do it again. Okay, that was a weaker version. That's. It was okay. It was four ninety, on the big fuck. Now let's. Rest, get the club out, and I'm going to do a strong attack and a weak attack, I guess, with the club, and we'll compare damages. Because the slam is about the same amount of time, and it's a similar stamina usage. So, how heavy are they as well? Uh, six weight a piece. <laughs> it's this exact same weight as, ha as the club alone. Okay. Dude, at this rate, I'm gonna have another level up before the end of the episode. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't know if attacking him from behind will do like extra critical damage. Just a normal power attack. 700 damage. Okay. Okay, it is significantly more damage, but. Hmm. Uh, that is a lot of damage. Uh, I mean, it's 306. But yeah, it's 306 before any scaling. 
that's 280 on plus six. Oh, wait, that is plus six. They're the same le- No, they're not. That's seven, that's six, okay. So I'm gonna guess that that would be close to 300 damage on plus seven. So a single weapon, it's, it's basically the same damage. Can you let me know in the comments if it would be more damage if I had both halberds on plus seven than the club alone? Because I, I, that's very expensive to level them up just, just to test. I don't want to put so much shit into upgrading two halberds if it's less damage than my club right now anyway. Just let me know. Can you see how many to level? There. All oh, right, I see. I need 1,000 souls to level up, I think. That is so handy. Right, sorry, no, I need 11 minutes, so I need one. I need 2,000 souls. Um, forgive me, I'm just wasting y'all time now. Let's get a couple more kills and I'll just level up one last time, fuck it. That's enough souls right there. Jesus Christ. Great place to farm. Not that I would. And just to be clear, I'm not going to farm for souls just to level up. That's, um, I'm happy to only level up with souls that I get naturally. You know, not counting two kills just then. That doesn't count. God damn it. I just want to uh, start next episode with zero souls. So we can just go full ham at the start of the next episode. Bearer of um, honestly, I'm I'm tempted to go up to thirty decks. Just start more more decks, please. More power stancing, etc. Right, my hard drive is going to be full in ten minutes. Let's go drop my stones, and then we'll call it uh, uh, the end of the episode. Well, we're here. You, you. Oh, you don't have to tell me. Sm you, small you. one. Give us yeah. Da, da. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, you. No, you get off. You. Shut up. There. Divine bone. Okay, fine, that's fine. Fine, it's okay. Maybe one day I'll use those. Petrified stone. There. Leave. Ta oh fucking hell! You see, you get lots of slabs. Yes, you. Y you literally get more slabs than chunks. At least I have so far in the game. I've got like four slabs. Up. In fact, how many have I got? Six. I got fucking six slabs and like two chunks. I've used one of those two chunks. You must be able to buy chunks at some point, maybe late game. Let's uh, end the episode by saying hello to the witches. I've killed a couple of bosses since I last visited, so they might give me something like a... Well, I don't know. They gave me a ladle <laughs> at some point. Maybe they'll give me a ladle plus one. Hello? How you doing? It's been a minute. Hello! The old winniness. Oh. Long ago, but now. Fine then. Well, fuck you. You unwelcoming women. And we'll stop him in Jula. Thanks for joining for this. Dude. Should I record these like two hours at a time? I swear to God, after a certain amount of time, I either become a blubbering wreck or I just am too stressed to speak clearly and pronounce my words properly. And speak like a human where you can understand me. I think the stress gets to stress fatigue <laughs> from like four hours of just slaughter and my own failings. Oh. Um. Right, I just I just wanna see. I just wanna I've got to see right before I end the episode. 
900 souls I don't give a fuck about. I will kill myself here and we'll be back in Medulla. Um, but I want to see if I don't have to pay Mr. Lado Boy and I can put on my little cat ring and go for a dip. Hello! <sighs> oh, that fucking worked wonders. Well, fuck you and your ladder, sir. Um... Right, if I loot, I keep the loot, don't I? Um, shit. Maybe I'll get an item here, right now, that will help me in the iron keep. There's an idea. Radiant gem, that's always nice. Okay, what else do we get for free? Another lockstone? Hey! Thank you. Oh, this, this looks easy. Fucking easy compared to that thing in Elden Ring. Where you drop the, the room to get down to the cursed fire thing. Oh, fucking hell, I spent like two hours on that shit. <laughs> um, it's fine. It's, 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 uh... Oh, fuck, I need to end the episode. I've intrigued myself now with the idea of having a useful item, perhaps, now. That will help me. Because they're right here, nice and easy. Yeah, fuck it. Let's try and get all these items, but I won't commit to this place, you know? Lesson learned the single logs are not landable. Uh, in fact, I think I get it. I, if I jump onto there, I can't go further down. Can I? Unless I leap. I might be able to leap. And it is lower down. Um. <sighs> Not bad. Not bad at all. Poison moss times three. I was hoping for like a unique item. Like a fire defense ring or something, you know? Oh, what a way to game the system that would be. I wouldn't say no to, like, a bonfire, though. A nice, fast way later. Right, okay, there's some serious-looking shit there, like a, like a rat skull. Bonf- okay, let's get the bonfire. Oh, don't- don't eat me, please. Oh, fucking hell. Right, okay, we'll- we'll come back in the future. Okay. Uh, oh, fuck. Um. Not a thing. It is not a thing. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm guessing you can't... Uh, I had to be on that side. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> I don't think I've got the max health for this. Jesus, take the wheel. <laughs> well, fuck you then. Oh, I see that ledge there. I need to stop, I need to stop. What's wrong with me? Come on, stop the episode. Just, just say your outro, and we'll do this next time. Why are my fingers betraying what I just said? Why are my fingers continuing? Fingers, I'm the boss. Stop making progress. Oh god, can you slip down onto that? Oh, oh. Oh, this is, gonna, this is gonna be fucking pixel perfect, man. <laughs> That's a no! Oh fuck, I'm intrigued now. I'm intrigued. <laughs> Maybe you can't do. Maybe if I put your jester's shoes. Did I buy the, the fall damage shoes? I didn't, did I? You fucker. I didn't, did I? I fucking did. I fucking did. My health is reducing, though. <laughs> uh, I'm not going human now at the end of the episode when I'm just pissing about. Let's just hope I've got enough. I might be able to survive that, you know. 
I've got two methods of fall damage reduction. Come on. Come on now. <sighs> oh my god. Yes, I don't know what it is, but yes. That looked like a PvP item to me. <sighs> okay. Let's just give that a quick read. I think Evil Eye is something to do with PvP that I've got no interest in. Absorbs... Oh. Absorbs HP. Right, okay. Interesting. Um, Bonfire? No, okay. Let's, um... I'm, I got a home bone. I'm going to waste a home bone. I should never have come down here. Uh, if you see what I'm saying. But I got a few bits. Okay. Like this video if you liked it. Like this video if you didn't like it and subscribe for similar content. Oh my fucking god, this game. <laughs> I'm loving every minute of it. I've said I've said it before, I'll say it again. Don't mistake my um bawling my eyes out <laughs> as me not enjoying it. What a fucking game. This is my shit right here, and I'm loving it. All my social media links are in the description, and I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content and my playing of these games. I'll be buying Dark Souls 3 soon. Uh, I don't know how soon. I think I've got a lot of game to go left. Um, but yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Liquid Blitz. Liquid Blitz.